Welcome back to Trade Journey with Jeeves, guys, and today we're doing a little bit of a different video. So we bought a storage unit about two... Two and a half months ago -ish. Two, sometime around there. And we found <laughs> boxes of these vintage toys, and we were like, well, let's go through them on a bit later time on a different video, and we realized we never did that. We still get comments, people asking what was in the boxes completely. So we figured, yeah. let's go ahead and go through all these vintage toys and see what else we got in this unit, guys. Don't forget to like the video, subscribe if you're new. Let's get into it. So before we get into the boxes though, we want to say a huge thank you to everyone who showed up Saturday for the first live auction. It was so much fun and we crushed it. So definitely planning on doing it again this Saturday. We're going to try to make it a weekly thing. Saturday, 2 p.m. Pacific time, 5 p.m. if you're on the east and whatever in the middle, I'm not really too sure. <laughs> but 2 p.m. Pacific time and we have a lot of cool stuff again. A lot. Trust me. This one might be even better than last time. Don't want to miss it. Be ready for 2 p.m. Pacific time, live auction, it's gonna be epic. So first, let's go through this big white box because it's kind of blocking me. I feel like I'm hidden. Nobody likes me. All right, let's see. So some of this stuff we might have showed on video. I don't really remember. I just know the details of it we never went through. So we got this giant Aladdin poster here. Kaboom. And we got this giant Aladdin frame. Kaboom. And this is Aladdin a rug. rug. A bath mat. Well, all right. <laughs> a lot of the stuff's Aladdin, so a lot of it is, but a lot of people love Disney, everything, so I figured let's just show everybody I'm before we sell it. Pretty sure literally everything is Aladdin. Other I don't, than there. And there's well, this, there. yeah. But I think everything like in this box right here and this box is all Aladdin. We got an Aladdin towel. And here we get started to get some of the figures. Like this is a Hallmark keepsake ornament of Jasmine in Aladdin. Ba boom Is that in there? Yeah, it's in there. Yeah. Then we got this Aladdin scented <laughs> bubble bath. They literally kept everything Aladdin, guys. Everything. Anything that was themed Aladdin. Let's see what else we have in here. This is Aladdin, Aladdin Little Library books, brand new. Might have put some of these up, these lots up for auction too on Saturday, so more people come and start messaging us like crazy this weekend. All right, that's just a little piece of paper. We got a lot of Aladdin books in here. I don't think I'm gonna go through all these, but Aladdin trace books, Aladdin, Aladdin. Sticker books. This is an Aladdin puzzle, you see that? Never even opened. Coloring sticker books. All the stickers are still in there too. More Aladdin. Oh, that's cool. And look at this, Aladdin cup. What else do we have in here that's not books? Let me pull stuff that's new. So we have this golden sound story a lot of books. Remember these? You <laughs> press the little button and it talks for you. Everyone remembers those. So these are just used books, used books. I'm gonna pull out only new stuff. This is an Aladdin rubber stamp collection. Hmm. Interesting. Some of this stuff definitely could have good collector value on eBay since it is older and it's a show or a movie that everybody likes. This is this is just straight gift wrap. What's the guy's name? I mean, I know he's just the genie. I don't know his uh, name. I thought he had a name. <laughs> I'm pretty sure he does. This is like a little Aladdin paint set here. What do we have over here? Aladdin nightlight? It just says genie. So oh, Aladdin, yeah, Jasmine, it says genie, Jafar, I guess is the dark man. Look at this guy. Lago's hmm. the bird. Raja hmm. is Jasmine's pet tiger. And Abu is Aladdin's monkey. Another. Cool. This one's still brand new to shrink wrap as well. There's a lot of other books in here, guys. But like I said, I'm just not going to take out every single one because they're just used books. This is, what is that? This is this memo game? It's like memory? Huh. Memo game. But again, it looks brand new. Plastic just a little bit. And this is what? What is this? A mug. An Aladdin coffee mug. Should I take it out? It doesn't. Uh, it's brand new, actually. I just ripped it. Oh, look at that. Brand spanking new Aladdin mug. And then we got, this is brand new. It doesn't have plastic on it, but it has like one of those sticky parts of cardboard that you can't, if once you open it, it's open. One of those. Then we got another game here. This is also a brand new puzzle. None of the words on the back of this memo game are in English. Hmm, that's kind of weird. This is another brand new Aladdin puzzle. Another Aladdin puzzle, brand new. <laughs> Never found a brand new Aladdin puzzle before. And then we have these two, which are, well. They're wood puzzles. Oh, they're brand new Aladdin wood puzzles. All right, what else we got in the box? We can get this one out of the way. This one's kind of big and obnoxious. 
These are Valentine's Day <laughs> cards. Uh, this is an Aladdin Abu. Abu. I don't even know what that is. A sound Let's scribbler. Say, just like, color, doodle, or draw to hear three fun sounds. That's kind of weird. Right. But that's in there. And the rest of this box is a lot of used Aladdin books in here. I'm not going to show them all to you, but like we said, just a bunch of books. Are these Aladdin too? Yep. I always it heard these part books. of the silver spoiler. Yeah, is it the gold little, ones little that are expensive? Gold books. He's got two of them. Is it the gold ones that are expensive? I always remember hearing that one of these have really expensive books to them. Let's see if we can see a date on this. Um, I remember having a whole bookshelf with the little gold books I when remember. I was younger. This is uh, 1992. I don't know when Aladdin came out, so I don't really know if that's an original. Yeah. But anyway, a lot of books in this right. one. Let's see if it's in the other couple. Alright, so the next thing we have is this Barbie box. So I'm. We, we were, weren't 100% sure, but pretty sure this came out of the same unit as this when, when we found all the Barbies. So it says the World of Barbie Double Doll Case for Barbie and Her Friends, and it has 1968 on it. So the box itself, I mean, some parts of it are peeling, but overall, I mean, it's still functional. It still opens as a box. Ooh. And it has two pockets over here. But... Here is, we have a few of these, which I know was found in the Barbie unit, but it's two brand new packs of just one outfit. So we have that. And then some, one thing that I've heard about Barbies a lot is that a lot of like the old, I guess years ago, a lot of people would make homemade clothes. And I don't really know how to tell the difference between a homemade item and something that was legitimately made from like the Barbie brand. This one has a Barbie tag in it, but I don't okay. know if that's newer ones. See, this has like original Barbie jeans on it. Okay. Okay. So, I don't, maybe it's obvious. This says Ken Mattel. This has sewing patterns in it that are literally but Barbie. it says Barbie. Yeah. Hmm. I mean, a nightgown. Like, this one has nothing. This leather jacket. Okay. Nothing in it. But I, I thought... Hmm. I don't know. I feel like a lot of the homemade stuff might be like <gasps> knitted. Like, I don't know. More something like this might be homemade. Oh my gosh. A leg. There's a leg in there. Another Just a old bunch type of dress. Definitely I mean, there's they, a lot of clothes in here. We might put all these Barbie clothes and put it up for one lot on the auction this Saturday. Yeah, and you guys, since um, the camera's so close to this stuff, you guys would be able to see it better. Yeah. I know a lot of people like to sit there and uh, piece stuff out, so we like to sell a lot of things in lots. What is that? A head! A head. Oh, jeez. A head and a leg. <laughs> but like, this, this is also a whole bag of clothes. Yeah. This is all just Barbie clothes. Tons of it. And I'm pretty sure if you piece these out, there's people looking for each individual piece for like 5 or $10 a piece. Easy. Yeah. You might be even have an expensive one in there. So we'll definitely hmm. probably sell all the Barbie clothes as one big lot during the auction on Saturday. So if you're interested in that, like we said, a lot of people like to break it up and be, you know, resell it yourself. We're cool with that. Other people can make their money. Let them do it. Let's get into that last box. Second Aladdin box we have here now. This has more of the glass like figurines in it and not so much as books and puzzles and everything. But we have another mug, which looks like the last one. So we might have two of these. This is actually a music box. I'm not going to twist it because so it's this. probably going to pay play some copyrighted stuff and get us demonetized. But I like that. I'll do it. See, Aladdin music box. <laughs> We're going to lose it. We're going to change so, it. Take um, it down. This says the San Francisco music box. Box company on the bottom. Mm, this doesn't say anything. And it's, um, it says hand painted. Mm -hmm. A whole new world. Malaysia. The music box is equipped with an on off stopper. Do not overwind. Same thing. Huh. Same stuff. And this does not seem to be broken either. Mm -hmm, neither is this. They're in good shape. Ah! Stop it. Stop it. <laughs> There's a switch on the back of it apparently that's triggering that. I thought I had to wind it. A washcloth? You know what that looks like? What? Whoever bought those things that like can come like really hard, you throw it in the water, and then it like comes <laughs> out to a washcloth. Yeah. This stuff. Look at that poor liquid soap container. It's yeah. kind of dead now. Silly string with jazz on the top. Silly string. Straw. Silly straw. <laughs> I was like, you found silly string? <laughs> I'm gonna spray you. Look at these. These are Disney story times, like the the yeah. cassette tape. Yeah, that you read along with it. And there's actually three of these. And this has the old Disney logo I haven't seen in a while. It's actually like Mickey Mouse in a tuxedo with a wand. Huh. 
These might be worth money too. They might be really old. I don't know. So this is brand new. This is um a necklace locket, but also like a a toy. So it has like the two figures, and you can put it in in the locket, I guess. Hmm. This is a Princess Jasmine slumber set. Another book. It's like literally a whole set in there. Look at that. You got like your brushes, your other brushes, and your facial tissues, and all kinds of stuff that looks like Princess Jasmine. Push back with me. Oh, this is a ring. <laughs> There's Princess Jasmine. See, I'm learning as I go in the tiger. I don't know the tiger's name, but it's there. Um, we have a lot of different stamps here, which they are all used, but here's the bird, the monkey, Jasmine and Aladdin and the monkey. Uh, this is the genie. A, a cake topper that's still in the plastic. Here's all of them on one stamp. What are all these guys? Just figures? That's a stamp collection. Look at this guy. What's his name? Jafar. Jafar. I'm not a Disney person if you can't tell. I never really watched Disney. And there you go again. The genie and I guess that's Aladdin himself. Another stamp. Here's another stamp with the tiger. Oh, look at this little statue too. Another stamp. Oh wait. Hmm. This one's trash. <laughs> the actual stamp is gone. Oh. <laughs> There's more figures in there. And we have a lot of like uh, plastic figures in here. Look at this. That's kind of cool. This is Jasmine. This is like Boom. a little car. Hmm. This is a collectible 3D button. And literally, this is what I've always been told. If it says collectible, it's not collectible. <laughs> They're trying to throw you off. Something I've been told. I don't know if it's true. So look, they have to see if it's Another one. Blue. Oh, wow. Another collectible button, 3D button. Is that another one? 30 album stickers to help complete your collection. Hmm. This is a candle holder set. Hmm. What else do we got in here? Look at this guy. What is he on? Is that a... The spoon straw. Maybe it's a bit of cereal. Oh, so you can drink the milk out of the cereal. I'm one of the few people that hate milk and cereal. It has to be dry for me to drink it. Or eat it. A balloon. A watch. That's Aladdin. And here's the ink pad. Oh, cool. Yeah, one, two, three ink pads. This is a little keychain. A couple little figures. Right there, two of the same one. Definitely still wet, so. Oh, uh, what? Princess Jasmine? Yeah. Yeah, open this. Look at this. See, he's not a bad guy. He's playing golf and stuff. He's all with three different colors. Remember that was like the coolest thing in elementary school? What? Stamp? Yeah. A couple more keychains. Oh, here's a part of the stamp. Oh, look. Is this monkey from Aladdin? Yeah. Okay. That's um, Aladdin's monkey. Hmm. There's that. This purple locket. What else we got in here? Rest that. We have a few more figures Look down here. Guy. The parrot. <laughs> Aladdin and his monkey. Ah, I see oh, a keychain. Look, here's the magic towel, the thing oh. that's supposed to grow in the yep. water. That's what we thought. That's what I thought the other washcloth was right there. It probably was. Hey, look. I thought that was paper at first. It was just a straight cutout. And here's the other one. Look. Yeah. It was just stuck to the balloon. This is like maybe one of the dollhouse at one time. Mm, a cork. And well, another Aladdin guy. And other than that, oh wow, look at this. I guess he was on a oh, McDonald's wow. Happy Meal bag at one time. <laughs> That's kind of cool. That's pretty cool. That is pretty cool. Here's another one. You know what I weirdly remember from McDonald's? Oh. It's that same yeah. thing. I weirdly remember, does anyone else remember these? That once upon a time, a long time ago, McDonald's sold Peter Pan toys and they were like little pieces of a ship and if you got all six of them, you can put it together and make one giant ship of Peter Pan. And were, I just remember distinctly missing the piece with Captain Hook on it and literally going to like 15 McDonald's with my granddad trying to find it, nobody had it. It took me like a year to find the freaking last piece of that thing. Never forget that. You know something that's cool about these bags is that I do remember them being like um, riddles and stuff. And all the answers are on the bottom of the bag. Oh, and this yeah. does say July 29th, 1996. Oh, so that's almost as old as me. So is that the same date? Where'd you see the date at? Right on the bottom. Yeah. July 29th, 1996. That's cool. Jeez. I did smell the bag to see if it smelled like old McDonald's, but. It smells like old dust. Yeah. Well, that's pretty much it in here. 
But again, we'll definitely make up some Aladdin lots if any of you guys are interested in this stuff. I know when we first showed Aladdin stuff, we got blew up in the comments. Yeah. Just like, hey, I want to see the Aladdin stuff in more detail. Show me the Aladdin stuff. Show me the Aladdin stuff. Show me the Aladdin stuff. Well, we'll try to show you the Aladdin stuff again. If you want to buy some of the stuff, make sure you're ready. Saturday, 2 ready. p.m. It was, I, I, I was so nervous beforehand and it was so much fun. Yeah, know, we were we awesome. were surprisingly, we had fun. It was a lot of fun. So, so I'm really hoping we even outdo last time, this time. That's my yeah. mindset. I want to outdo what we did before every single time. So get ready this weekend. I'm telling you, get ready. It's, <laughs> I can't say it enough. You're going to enjoy it. There's a lot of stuff for everybody. I try. We're trying to make it like the most diverse set of items. So no matter what you're into, we got something for you. That's my yeah. goal for this one. We got already weapons, sports stuff, coins, jewelry. Uh, we're gonna have toys. We're gonna have comics. I'm, mm -hmm. I'm trying. I don't know what else yet. Obviously, this is just Monday. We have auctions Wednesday, Thursday, Friday. Yeah. So, so who knows how many more lots we'll come up with until Saturday? Yeah. Well, we got a lot coming, guys. Make sure you're ready this Saturday, 2 p.m. Pacific time. You don't want to miss it. I can't say it enough. Anyway. Hope you enjoyed this little video. I figured this would be more fun to show everybody with toys instead of just scratching lottery tickets and losing. <laughs> so make sure you leave it a big fat thumbs up. Subscribe if you're new. And until next time, peace out.